Hey guys, what's up? It's um, getting one of those videos here, and today I'm just gonna be bringing you guys a little video tutorial for Adobe After Effects and stuff like that. So yeah, I'm gonna be teaching you the best settings for Twixter. Let's just let it open. Afro Circus. Circus. Pokemon. Afro. If it actually opens. Alright, it's gonna open. And just for kicks, I'm gonna put in some CC, so whatever. <clears throat> Hopefully, this will take 20 minutes to open. Which it usually doesn't. Cleaning up. I don't know. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Alright, here we go. Alright. So, let's let it load. Let it load. Still loading a little bit. Alright, here we go. So, I'm gonna drag in a clip. Um, I'm going to drag in a clip. Let's say I want... Hmm. Here's a good clip. I use this for my recent EP. So... Oops, why did I click on it? Oops. <laughs> I'm just gonna drag this in here. And then make his composition. Alright, um, wow, that already has CC on it. I wonder if it already has Twixter. Oh, yeah, this is the movie. This is the actual. Oops. <laughs> Alright, hold on. I said delete. Yes. Alright, hold on, I'm just clips. And then. And before, here we go. Alright, here we go. Alright, this should be the right one. Yeah, alright. Okay, so, um, let me just put some CC real quick. Alright. Boom. And when you add the effects, it might just take the CC off, but you just go back and press edit again. Alright. I can't tell, but I already know a good CC that I, that I like. Alright. This one, I already know that one looks pretty nice. It's the one I use for my CC. Oh, composition's all messed up. Hold on, let me just, let me just make this. So, um, first you're just gonna get your clip, and um, usually it takes about 10 seconds for a nice, good, slow twixter. So you're gonna wanna go to about, 10 seconds. So I'm gonna go to 30 just in case. Okay. And so what you're gonna do is right click on your layer, make sure it's selected. And so you're gonna go to time. You're gonna, <laughs> you're gonna go to time, enable timer mapping. And then don't worry about the keyframes. Just do this. Just click it and do this and just drag it all the way. Alright. So that's all you need to do. And that just really extends the clip. So then you're going to want to go to where you want your Twixter to start. I would say just about right when the shot goes. So let's go back a couple frames. One right on the muzzle flash. Uh, 
Okay, can we let's just go like that? There it is. Alright. Oh. <laughs> Alright, there it is. Perfect. Okay. So you're gonna wanna look up in your effects and presets. I already have a preset up there, but I'm gonna I don't have it on here, so look up Twixter. It's a plug in too, but there's ways to get it for free. So you're gonna just drag it on your clip. Alright. So you eat all this and you're like, then what am I supposed to do? So first, um, see it took off the CC, but it, uh, you can fix that easy. Um, so you'll figure it out by yourself. But anyway, uh, since my clip is uh, about 59.94 FPS frames per second, just change that to that. Really, if it's any lower, it's not gonna look too good. So you want just about that. So change the motion sensitivity to 100. And then go down to speed. And click the little stopwatch. Bam. And then you want to click on your layer and click U. There, there you see the speeds right there. So you're going to want to go forward one frame. Boom. And then you're going to want to change your speed to however slow. And uh, for trick sharks, I usually like 5 to 10. But if it's like a reload, then I want it 1 to 5. But this is just a trick shot. So we're going to go to about 8. So into that. And go to where you want the Twixter to stop. Which I want about right. Here. Yeah, that should be pretty nice. And then, so you're going to want to keyframe it by hitting this little diamond. Go forward one frame. And change the speed back to 100. Which should look pretty nice and smooth. Um, I will. I can't give you a render preview right now, but I might include a uh, little preview at the end. But you can see it's pretty nice. There's not much warping. And then to just redo the CC, I think you can either add more or you can just go and then click it a freaking again, cause. After Effects is stupid. Yeah, let me just add some more. Afro Circus, Afro Circus. Yeah, it looks pretty nice. Boom! Alright. So I'll probably include a little preview of it in the end. But yeah, it's pretty nice. So I'll just show you. It's, it's slow motion already in the kill cam, but it still looks pretty nice. Like, so yeah, it's pretty nice. Alright guys, thanks for watching. I'll uh, see you guys later. I, yeah, I finally got a screen recorder, thank the lord. But yeah, I will might put, put like some Happy Wheels gameplay up tomorrow or something like that. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. Peace.